Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jay Elise, and I am back with another video. Whew, I haven't said that intro in a good little minute, y'all. I haven't said it in a good little minute, but y'all can see I made my hot chocolate. Um, and you all see I did use almond milk in it. So you have to make sure that your water is extremely hot because you know the milk is cold, of course, and I put I balance it out that way I can literally just drink it like so. And it's so warm, y'all, and it feels so good. Only thing missing is my marshmallows, y'all. I do not have marshmallows. But this is not going to be a sit-down video, as you can tell from the title. It's going to be pretty much an update of everything and how everything went down and the aftermath of getting my wisdom teeth pulled. Now, it is going to be still a vlog-style video, but I just kind of want to sit down and tell y'all in the beginning, I just want to tell y'all exactly what happened and how I'm feeling now and how the recovery has been. Now, for those who don't know what I'm talking about, I ended up getting my wisdom teeth pulled December 9th. December 9th is when I got my wisdom teeth pulled and I haven't vlogged in like a week y'all which you all probably won't know notice the break because I had so many videos and the queue that was already ready so you all never realized that it was a break in between and this hot chocolate is making it real hot with this sweater on and everything y'all but it's so delicious so today is December 17th it's like it's 5.30 in the evening. Um, yesterday was my first day back at work, y'all. And so you all seen the video. I will put it up in the cards right here on the end screen for you all to check that video out. And and also the videos, y'all have to continue to watch it because it was vlogging. So everything was happening one day after another after another. So like the look clip that I had put in there, y'all, I did not know that I recorded that. I had no like... I had no type of memory or anything of recording that little clip right there until I went back to edit that video. Now, you all seen that I made a video afterwards and the next, the very next day I was feeling good. My mouth, it wasn't, my face wasn't really as swollen or anything. I was feeling real good. I vlogged for y'all, but, excuse me, I don't know if you all noticed, like towards the end of that video when I was applying the lip gloss labels, I ended up taking a break in between y'all because I started feeling a little pain. So I ended up taking some medicine and of course the medicine made me sleepy. So I ended up taking a nap in between, woke up and finished the video. Now, and it was extremely hard for me to finish that video. I don't know if you all like really paid attention to it, but it was extremely hard to finish the video. I'm gonna set that down so I'm not gonna talk during the whole video. And it's not gonna be long at all, y'all, but um, I just kinda wanted to update y'all on what was going on with me. So like I said, the very next day, all that was fine. So that was day one, day two, everything was going well. Um, as soon as I got it done Wednesday, and then Thursday was that very next vlog. Friday, what did I end up doing Friday? I don't, I'm not sure what I did Friday, which was day two. Um, I know is I don't know if it was day three, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. 
fun day. No. Day four. Day four is when it all hit me. Now, when I tell you, I went out and I thought I ended up, you know, I made that video. Y'all seen me go out that day. I was at, I went to Target to pick up some stuff. I was at Walmart. I was at, I was grocery shopping. I was everywhere, y'all. And it was extremely cold that day and it was also wet. So, which, you know, of course I had to have my mask on. But I made sure that it was like real tight around my mouth and everything. That way, you know, I won't get any type of air. Now, so when I woke up, like later that night, I started feeling a little pain. It's like, okay, did I just do a setback? Did I, did something go wrong? I thought I was all on Google, y'all. I think it's called a dry socket. And basically when the blood clock don't actually form in there and something else happened, y'all, I diagnosed myself like crazy on Google. I need to stop doing that because I've been diagnosing myself with so many different diseases and I don't everything y'all through Google I need to stop now so I, I couldn't sleep that night at all couldn't sleep that night at all so that's Wednesday Thursday Friday Thursday Sunday so that was day four so day five this is Monday now your girl was in a fetal position crying I was in a fetal position crying yeah at this point this pain is so It was so painful. Like it was so painful and I just, I couldn't sleep. The medicine not working. I'm in a fetal position. I'm crying y'all. And I have a very high tolerance for pain. So if I'm saying that I'm hurt or I'm in pain, just know that I'm in pain because I have a high tolerance for it. For one, I do not like taking medicine. For those who have been watching me for a while now, y'all know I like I like to do everything the natural way. I don't really, the heat just popped on if y'all can't hear it. I do have this new mic on here, so I really don't know if it's changed anything, but we'll see. But I like to do everything the natural way. I don't like taking medication for this, medication for that. So at the same time, it was like at the beginning, I was trying, I was waiting. I would wait to my pain level to get to like a number 10, level 10, before I actually take medicine because I try not to take medicine. Nope, couldn't do that. So I'm popping medicine like this. I'm popping medicine like this, y'all. And when I tell y'all the medicine was not working, it was only working for about uh, three hours. Three hours tops. And it said I can't take it from, um, I have to take it every six hours. And it was terrible. It was terrible. So it was like 7.58. I'm like, ooh, I got to call them. I got to call them. Tried to get in. I told them, you know, I think it's infected. I was so I take it. This little TMI, I started tasting a little pus and it was freaking disgusting and it smelled so bad. So you can just imagine the taste that was in my mouth. Now, I ended up getting, I didn't even tell you, I ended up getting three of them taken out. The two top ones and then the bottom left one. Now the bottom left one, that one was growing in sideways. So I had, he said as he was trying to take them out and ended up breaking in pieces, which is why I had to get the stitches. And that's where all the pain was coming from. So I told them, you know, what was going on. I'm like, yeah, I got to get me in today. They was like, no. And I'm like, ah, oh, ain't got no sooner. So they was like, nah. So I'm like, all right, I'm just rocking. I end up going to sleep the whole day and to 12 o'clock or whatever. I went up there. He said everything was going. Everything was healing well. He said the pus and everything is just the stitches dissolving. I'm healing. He basically called me old. Oh. He's like, you know, when you're early, you know, teenager, teenage age, and it's like 20s, you know, you heal faster, you bounce back a little faster, but when you're in your 30s, you take a little longer to, you know, you take a little longer to heal. So I'm like, okay, you just said you calling me old at this point now, so, okay. He's like, yeah, I'm in my 30s too, and you know, it's just what happens. So, well, I said, well, you're going to have to prescribe me something because... Honestly, the medicine you're prescribing me is not working, and I would hate to have the OD on this medicine. And yes, I said it because I'm not. Anybody know? I have been cut three times, meaning three C sections. For those who don't, I had three C sections, and this toothache pain tops it all. It tops it all. That little thriving. Ooh, whoever had a toothache, y'all know what I'm talking about. Comment down below if y'all feel my pain. Y'all ever had a toothache? But 
end up getting um prescribed me something else the same medicine that i had in in a um a higher dosage and then he also told me to get some over-the-counter mortrin that way i can take it every four hours you know and got, kind of go back and forth so when it got me some soup and everything yeah i don't know i was weight because i wasn't eating Ooh, excuse me all i was drinking was hot chocolate I even stopped drinking my tea for a minute, y'all. All I was drinking was hot chocolate and eating soup. I couldn't really eat too much more. Like it was just, it was too much, y'all. I could, I couldn't pretty much, I couldn't do anything. And so I ended up getting home. I ended up taking the Mortrin, and when I tell y'all that Mortrin killed that pain like that, it killed the pain like literally killed the pain and. And I was feeling good. I was feeling good. So I stopped taking the, uh, they had me on oxycodone, um, which is like a generic for a, a Percocet. Because I told them do not prescribe me a Percocet because I didn't like the way it made me feel when I had my C-section. So, I, like I said, I don't like the way medicine make me feel. It kind of slowed me down and it's, my heartbeat started beating real fast. And like the, even the oxycodone, it kind of, my energy went up and then all of a sudden it just went pew. It declined and I was just I had to lay down but um but here it is y'all I am on day what is today I said today is the 17th today is Thursday I am on day 9 and as you all can see I am feeling a lot better I am feeling a lot better and I am taking just Mortrin now I'm not taking any of the prescribed medicine or anything and I'm down to take it as I took it like at nine o'clock this morning and it's five o'clock. So I've actually had went 12 out 12 hours without taking medicine and it's actually is doing really well, y'all. But I've been in the bed, which is why I have not been vlogging. I mean, who finna vlog doing all that? Uh, I literally been in the bed and I'm finna show y'all in a minute. That's when this vlog finna start going, you know, I'm finna show y'all some stuff that I end up getting. But I'm just steady getting stuff in the mail. I had to do all my Christmas shopping. Just finish everything online. Like, and y'all know with Prime, I've been doing that two days. And, and I have a few other things that's coming. Um, I've been getting stuff every day. And I have a few other things that's coming from different websites. But that's pretty much it, y'all. But like I said, I'm going, I'm up to 12 hours now without taking any medication. It still throbs. It still hurt. I can't, I still can't eat like solids or hard food or anything. I'm still only able to chew on this side here. Um, it, it's a process, but I can say I am headed in the right direction now because at that day four, he was like, that's the peak of it. That was the peak of it because baby, it felt like I just wanted to take my freaking mouth and just throw it away because it was also the pain was going into like the bottom teeth now. And it was like, I just wanted to take them all out y'all. It was just, it was terrible. For anybody that's watching, bless you. I would not recommend, I mean, I guess if you don't really don't have to take them out unless you have an issue, but one of mine was kind of cracked, it was like chipped or whatever, and it was, I was having so much build up on them, so, and I got tired of having to take that little pickle to brush my teeth all the way back there, and then this one down here, um, no, this one up here was going to cause my other one to have, a, it was just a lot going on, but I would not recommend waiting until you get to your 30s to, um, get your wisdom teeth removed i would not recommend it i would not recommend it y'all because it is painful and like i said and i have a high tolerance for pain y'all and like i tell y'all it's just i cannot do a toothpick i cannot do it but i survived it i'm here my first time like eating a straight meal meal was yesterday i ended up eating the chili cheese dog um, I still have to take little small bites. I can't just go off. Oh, I still have to take little small bites when I eat, but we slowly getting back up there, y'all, because we all know I cannot afford to lose any weight. I can't afford to lose no weight. Um, but I think that was pretty much it, y'all, but it, it was terrible. It was really terrible, y'all, and I just, like, I just... I'm glad that I was able to vlog the experience because it's always good to kind of look back and see what happened, you know, what I went through, and just for other people to see, ooh, excuse me, my experience with things. Um, it, it it was 
It was a nice little experience. I'm going out with 2020 with a bang, cause that was a bang. I'm just like, I hope I'm, I'm hoping that I'm able to eat some real food by Christmas, y'all. And that's all I'm gonna say. I'm hoping that I can eat some food, but I am 15 minutes into this right here, y'all. We're just talking and running my mouth, but let's go ahead and jump into the vlog. All right, in case y'all was on. Um, Wondering about how my little setup was, y'all. I literally just took the throw blanket that I was sitting on, which you couldn't really see that in the video anyways. That was um, right there. And then also I just took, you know, the pillow that was on the couch and I just put them like under the tree. And then I just put the fireplace on, which kind of got part of it in there. I really couldn't see the candle that was lit or whatever. But yeah, yeah, I got a little easy little cute look christmas setup or whatever then of course my hot chocolate and then i had my little stand well actually it was like about right here it was about right there and then of course i had the ring light so let me go ahead and put my little stuff back on the couch real quick corner supposed to be down like that but I don't like my stuff to like drape and hit the floor and this tag is not supposed to be showing either but um but yeah y'all that's pretty much how I just threw that back together couch and stuff is still the same I did not go and add any more pillows because Christmas is gonna be here and all this stuff is gonna come down which actually I might keep it because it's really not Christmas thing like um all I gotta do is just take that centerpiece off and stuff. I don't know, y'all, but yeah. All right, y'all, we got Bug in the bed here. Say hi, Bug. Bug. Mm. <laughs> you gonna say the Buggy vlog hi? Hey. <laughs> yeah, she just woke up from a nap. Um, but as you all can tell, I have been just letting my packages build up. I haven't been doing anything with them, y'all. I just been. I was just laying in bed, y'all. Just laying in bed. And it's more. Hmm. And it's more. Like I really haven't been doing anything, y'all, but just laying in the bed. Like I said, just trying to recover and just try to get myself together. Girl, I'm gonna put that on pause. Yeah, I'm sure they're watching. Um, on yet next year. I don't know, and Elsie, y'all. We gonna have to pause that, baby. Let me try to vlog real quick. Um, but yeah, yeah, I haven't really been doing anything too much of nothing. So I am going to go through a little bit of these packages to kind of show y'all what I've got. Like I said, it is later on in the evening. I'm not doing too much, but I did just want to kind of fill y'all in on what was going on with me. I don't even know where my phone is. But, um, but yeah, y'all. So let me see. Y'all, people been... I have literally, I had just, um, just started back posting on social media, y'all, um, post a little picture or whatever, and on my inbox, my inbox is blowing up, inbox is blowing up, y'all, um, I only been missing a week, I only been missing a week, but I do appreciate the love, like I said, I feel so much better, y'all, it's still a little pain, but then Mortra knocked it right on out, um, still just a little pain, like I said, I did take it around like 9 this morning, and I'm not going to take it again until right before I go to bed because I will hate to have to wake up in pain. But like I'm said, like I said, I'm slowly weaning myself off of it though. So I'm slowly weaning myself. Oh yeah, this hot chocolate is like freaking cold right now. But I'm finna still drink it. Like there's literally a sip left in here. And I end up getting these mugs for the girls. Um... I think it was like, I don't know if it was last Valentine's Day from Walgreens. Y'all know it came with the whole little s'mores little set. And this mug is actually huge. It's really huge. But let me show y'all a few things that I did get in the mail. Let me see if y'all can look in this mirror here. So y'all, um, I ended up getting 
this little mic so as you can see it's like a little bracket is it gonna focus there you go it's like this little bracket right here that it's sitting on I had to actually purchase that separately and then the mic itself which is right here um so I did just put that on there literally just right before I did the video and it does come with this little wind little thing as well y'all I don't know if we're gonna better hear a difference but uh oh let me just pop this on show y'all how this looks kind of cover up that uh, light so basically if I'm outside or whatever um I will just put this on to kind of break that wind up that way you won't hear as much but it looks so good y'all okay I'm steady investing in my channel it's looking really good I'm trying to block this little light um but I would say I would get a smaller one because this is like the same size as a freaking camera so I don't really want that one but um but yeah that's the new little mic set I end up getting um got it all from amazon i will leave links down below if you guys were interested but there's a lot of this other stuff that i really can't pull out and show you all because of the fact that they are christmas gifts for the girls but let me show y'all what i got Ooh, i might have to get my other tripod y'all just might have to get my other tripod i'm trying not to switch back and forth i don't feel like doing all that Oh. There we go. Didn't even have to switch, y'all. But like I said, everything came well. A couple of these came today. Um Let me know when I do the stop. A couple of these came today and they literally just been coming in all week, y'all. But like I said earlier, I was not today Thursday of course I was I was just y'all the kids were just bringing them in here just piled them up but I did end up getting this right here of course you all know this by now um I don't really like to jump on trends y'all so when stuff be going around I don't really like doing it so when it kind of died down that's when I like decide to get it or whatever but this one right here I just thought it was just so cute for one I just seen the way people was wearing it. Like, I don't like that chunkiness of it, y'all. And I guess, I don't know if it's the way people had it sitting on their head or whatever. But but I ended up getting this one here. And just look at the sparkles. Just look at that. It is so freaking beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Just shiny. So, I did get this. Let me put my stuff back how I had it. What time is y'all? It's 6. I'm probably doing too much talking because my mouth like is trying to hurt. But I'm not taking any medicine until at least 9 o'clock. I'm not. Unless it start hurting too bad. And like I said, I got that. I got the mic and everything that came in the mail. I end up getting this phone case right here. And yeah, I have a million phone cases, but I think I'm going to end up selling them. Because I don't really... I was just going crazy with phone cases. So it looks like this. And it does have like a protective of like a peel on it, but I'm not actually going to take it off right now. Um so I can find my phone. Oh. Where is my phone at? right y'all it's pretty much a noodle night we are all eating noodles tonight because i'm still eating soft stuff y'all still eating soft stuff but i'm gonna take the little protective little film off and y'all see this is the one i currently have on my phone right now which i love this one this one's been on my phone for the longest and i do have a pink one like this everybody for some reason think my phone cracked but it's not and i do have the um it's like space gray. And it's just, oh, it is so cute. And it looks like this, y'all. Look how cute it is. I think it's so, like, dainty. Very cute. Sleek. Love it. 
Love it, love it. Um, and then I also end up getting some cocoa butter. I'm actually going to do a vlog, probably probably in tomorrow's vlog, y'all. Because I'm going to try to keep my vlogmas going and start it back up. Because I am feeling better because, like I said, I had a break. But you all didn't notice that I had a break. Uh, but I did end up getting this cocoa butter. Now, I used to um, use this cocoa butter like a long time ago, y'all, for my daughter, um... Jabrielle, y'all know she's 16 now. She used to have really, really bad eczema on her face or whatever. And I used to put this on her face. And when I tell y'all, it cleared it right up. It cleared it right up. Oh, and it smells so good. It smells so good. Mm, mm, mm. And it says for it, um, face and body cream. It soothes and softens extremely dry skin. And it says intense moisture. And it is by Queen Helen. Now, I can't say, y'all, this right here, this one works good. Please do not try to get the, the lotion because the lotion, mm -mm, the lotion don't work good for nothing, y'all. When I tell y'all that lotion, it makes you dry. Like, I hate using the lotion part. But I end up getting that. You all seen the mic. Um, this whole box right here is pretty much gifts yeah i can't show y'all that because that's for the girls i am going to do a christmas um thing on y'all on what i got for christmas and stuff and i end up getting uh i end up getting a half wig y'all now this is my second time ordering this wig here make myself don't come snap up and it's this right here now, um, this is my second time ordering this wig right here, and I love this wig. It is a half wig, and the style is Ashanti. Um, it's in 1B30. Y'all know that's like the little brown highlights with black. Um, like I said, second time wearing it, and I thought it would be really cute with the headband. That's kind of why I ordered it together. So, I did do that. Um... I got a couple of other videos that I need to do soon, y'all. Some sponsored videos, so y'all look out for that. And I think the rest of these boxes is like gifts. I've opened up some of them. Let's see. All these are just some syringes, y'all. Yeah, I know the last time I told y'all I was out of syringes, so I did order some more syringes. And this is a set of 1060 ml. From Amazon, I will leave everything down below for you all if you guys were interested. Um, now I didn't get a chance to show y'all my candles. I don't know, the this video is already a little bit long. Cool, we had 10 minutes. Yeah, this video is already a little bit long, so I'm gonna kind of break my content up so I can at least have some content for y'all. So I'm gonna show y'all my candles and everything later because I'm still waiting on some, y'all. and. I don't even know exactly how they broke everything up and how they priced everything, but I don't know what they did. I don't know what they did. I guess I'll see it once everything is finalized, y'all, because I only have six candles. I ordered like 14 candles. Yeah, pretty upset. Because as I told y'all, they kept taking candles away. They literally... They literally, I kept getting emails and they were saying, oh, this is, they took this off my order, they took this off my order. Like, they literally kept sending me emails like that. And like I said, a lot of this stuff, y'all, is for the girls and stuff. Meaning, y'all, I haven't wrapped not one gift. I haven't wrapped not one gift in. It's going to be hell trying to wrap all these gifts at once. I'm going to vlog it, though. Y'all will not actually vlog, see me doing it because, like I said, they watch the videos sometimes. Um... What I'm gonna do, y'all, and which I really wasn't even realizing that Christmas was next freaking week. Should I leave this on here right now? Yeah. Yeah, I'll leave it on there. But one thing I can say about the phone cases, y'all, I like the square versus the rounded. You all can see. I love how to tie square off. Like, I love these types of phone cases. I've been ordering these cases for a while now. For a good little minute. That one do just feel a little bit more sleek, but I think I need to clean it off. I didn't I need to clean it off first. Woo! I 
All right, and it's one more thing I really want to show y'all before I kind of log off or whatever. Um, I have been working on my planners, which I will be going into a detailed video about that and all about unique custom designs. Uh, so if you guys are not following me over on Unique Custom Designs LLC, I will leave it right here. Make sure you all go follow me. Uh, I just bit my tongue. Mm -mm -mm. Whew. It's like a bit down on it, like right there. Um, go follow your girl over on Unique Custom Designs. Um, I do have my two winners, which um, and I do actually I have my two winners over on Unique Custom Designs, and I have my and I do have my two winners for my vlogs, for my vlogmas. Um, like I said, I was I am picking a winner per week. Like I said, y'all need to leave comment on videos. I understand I do have my uh, people who watch me on TV or whatever and do not comment. I'll make my own noodles too. What'd you say? Is my noodles done? I said I'm making my own noodles. Okay. I'm... They went off already? Yeah. All right, here I come. I'll be having to make my own noodles, y'all. Nobody might make my juice and stuff. Ooh, that's my stuff from Five Below, y'all. When I tell y'all I've been ordering stuff. And that was my first time ordering from Five Below, y'all. And it shipped off already. So I'm wondering if it will actually be here by Christmas. Like I said, um, I understand people do be watching on TV. And you can't um, comment or whatever. But that's understandable too. But I know I do have my my vlog supporters out there. And that's pretty much what I'm trying to do, y'all. Y'all know I be, I be going in with my vlogs. And I'm just trying to build that audience. Versus I have a really good lip gloss audience. But now I'm trying to build that. That vlog audience. Because I don't want to wait until I get. You know. 50, 60, 70, 100 subscribers. And then try to switch over my content. Because that's not what I'm trying to do. Because at that point it's like okay. You have that amount of subscribers. I say if I have 100k subscribers. And I'm only getting. Like 5,000, 6,000 people. That's only watching. My vlogs like this, this it's not adding up, sis. It's not adding up at all. But um, let me show y'all what I did. I, I've been doing more templates, and let me just set y'all right here. Oh, y'all have to go get my noodles. Let's look into it. I don't want my juice to fall out, y'all, but y'all see. It's my noodles. Cause y'all, like I have only been, I still only been eating soft foods. I can't really still. I can't eat anything solid. I can't eat like nuts or anything like that. Especially stuff that can get stuck and especially jammed up into my teeth. Still not eating any of that. Like literally, y'all, every day I was eating soup. I was drinking hot chocolate. And then I was, um, I ate a lot of fruit cups, which y'all know I love my fruit cups. I, the bubble fruit cups. Fruit cups. I love those. Been eating those like crazy. But y'all, I just, I can't say I feel, feel 80 I'll say 85% better. Yeah, I feel 85% better. This is the first day I can't say, which is why I started to watch, which is why I picked up the vlog. This is the very first day. Ooh, I have to grab my phone real quick. This is the very first day that I feel like I'm myself and I'm just getting myself in order now, y'all. Like, I feel really good. But, which I showed y'all my journals before, but I end up making some templates. So, as of right now, which I had showed you guys these. These are the three journals that I have. Well, this is the planner. And this is, I didn't open them. This is like the dot journal. I don't know if you all can see the little dots. I love these types of journals. Um, then this one here is a regular line journal. I love them both. Love them both. But this one here, this is one that I was just playing with and and I was making the, this is one of the little um, things that I do have in it y'all. This is like, it's supposed to be like my minimal, minimalist <laughs> planner and that's kind of one style that I have. And then the other ones that I've been working on it are these right here. Um, it, it's not purple y'all, it's actually... It's actually like that um, gold color, which you see it turned to purple because my ink ran out and I'm not about to replace my ink, which I have, but I'm not about to replace it when I'm testing stuff out. But these are pretty much my um, my template y'all that I'm still playing with. I had even like the little pink ones. Um, I had this type of style here 
And I prefer. Let me, let me get it shot. I'm all over the place. But I prefer this style over this style here. It's just, just overall, this one looks a lot better. So I'm gonna stick with this style here. And then I do have like an expense tracker. Um so as y'all see, I've been playing around like month at a glance with just all of my little um pages and stuff. And how I'm going to do it, which this is the front of it. And I'm just waiting for my noodles to um cool off too, y'all. And this is the front of it. And I see I had two, I have two different girls, but I think she looks a lot better. I just kind of didn't really want to go on with the pink shirt. So I have, oh, don't fall. But I have this girl right here. Uh, I think this one just looks really good. And, well, she looks really good too. Like I said, I have, I'm going to have two different styles or whatever, but this is the one that I'm going with. Um, I haven't did anything. I just printed it out. And then, like, on the back of it, you are, you're, you're an original, which on this one here, y'all see I didn't put anything. Um... And I got this agenda belongs to. I have all of the holidays now. I have the calendar here, which I need to move it up some because it's still too much space right there. And then I have the month at glance, and it's going to be like the monthly budget tracker. Like I will go into details about all of that. Which I will go into details about all of that, y'all, when I do the actual video and discuss everything that's going to go down with unique custom designs. Um, you can see I've been playing with it. Um, so when I say this little downtime, I've not posted on social media. It felt so good. Um, like I said, my videos are already scheduled to go out every day. As of right now, it's looking like everything I've scheduled everything to go out at 3 p.m. Everything is pretty much. Oh. Everything was pretty much um, scheduled out. So while laying in the bed, y'all, I have been going through my emails, deleting my emails and everything. But I'll go into all of that into another video. But this was pretty much just an update. And I did want to kind of go in and show y'all a little of the stuff that I've been doing, what's been going on. Like I said, it's the 17th. I have a lot to prepare for as far as for 2021. And... That I'm not trying to get this planner down and done because I need to start making plans and everything. But this video is already long enough and I'm trying to get it edited so it can go up. But I thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all made it to the end of this video. Um, like I said, I know you all didn't see a break in between the videos of me recording. But it was about a week break and it feels good to be back y'all. It just feels my mind is renewed. And I have a whole lot of content that I, I didn't even think that I was going to finish Vlogmas. Um, honestly, I was done. I was literally done. And to, in my mind, I'm like, I'm not doing Vlogmas no more. I'm just done. But the fact that I still had videos going out so I never missed a day. I'm like, you know what? I can go ahead and finish it. Just a couple more weeks. Just a couple more weeks, Jessica. And I do have a bunch of family vlogs that's going to be coming up next. We are going to be making the gingerbread houses. We're going to be making cookies, brownies, Rice Krispie treats, little fun stuff like that, etc. We have us like a little movie night and everything going on. As far as me, I had some stuff that I wanted to do. Wind down, like actually wind down and stuff. Which I don't think that I'm going to be able to do because I'm not going to be drinking for probably the rest of this year. Especially while I'm on medicine, I'm not going to be drinking anything. I'm not going to be drinking anything, especially while taking this medicine and stuff, y'all. Um... So, I still want to do the video. Like, it's a really good video. But, um, but I have to drink the wine with it, y'all. I have to drink the wine. That's the whole point of my wine down. Like I said, I, I really don't care about it. My health is more important. So, I just want to take this time to heal so I can step into 2021. Feeling good. Looking good. Um, uh, y'all can see my hair is holding up really good. I did go through and we retwist it. Again, this is my third time twisting my hair. Yeah, as y'all can tell, it looks really good. So once it started like getting the little strands of hair, all I do is literally untwist, like it's twisted all the way down. Literally just untwist it and twist it right back up, y'all, to make it feel like a little bit tighter. This is like the best protective style ever. And I think I may end up I may end up keeping this hairstyle up until next week. Uh, so I think I'm gonna end up changing it for Christmas, but then again, I don't know because the girls want their hair like this now, so 
I will be busy doing their hair like that, which I will be vlogging that too. But I'm about to get ready and eat my noodles, y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for everybody who supported me and my video, you know, of everything that went down. Like, the love is so real with y'all. I love you guys. Don't forget to continue to comment. So, way I, got, I still have two more winners that I need to pick for this week and also next week. And yeah, and that's pretty much all that I have for you guys today. So if you all haven't subscribed already, make sure you all hit the subscribe button, like, comment, and I'll see you guys in my next video.